My name is Schmitty, and I'm going to be your best friend for the next 10 minutes or so, anyway. <laughs> Great names. What is that, Dutch? Super. Let's do this. Here's round one. I'm going to beam two prompts to your device. Answer them however you choose. What you type goes up against what someone else types, and everyone votes on the winner. You score based on the percentage of players who like your answer. Plus, there are winner's bonuses at stake. Go! Great, let's see what we got here. Number one on the list, an inappropriate time to wear a tuxedo. Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. Moving on, the wrong thing to say after farting in church. And vote. Next one, the biggest secret a chimpanzee has told Jane Goodall. Get to voting! Starbucks barista would write on the cup for Mohandas Gandhi. Vote on your devices. Deck, the name of a bar with no bathrooms. It's voting time. Round one's done. Let's see who's in the lead. Ah. Here, 
comes round two. Hey, if you liked round one but thought all the points should be doubled, have I got the round for you. Let's start this show. Prompt number one is a job you'd be surprised requires a urine test. Okay, select your favorite quip. Next is a good sign there's an invisible man living in your apartment. Ready, set, vote! Okay, next one. What a lazy cowboy names his horse. Time to vote. Next in the hopper, you know you're old when you're at a bar and the bartender asks you, blank. Vote now. Exciting rule for Monopoly. Pass, go, and collect blank. Okay, vote. Round two is through. Let's see what it did to the scores.
That's right, it's round three, the last lash. Look alive, because you're all getting the same prompt this time. Come up with the full name for this acronym. Let's see what you've wrought. It's round three, so you've got three medals to award. A gold, a silver, and a bronze. Make your picks. Let's see who earned those medals. Bronze. Here's the silver. And gold. Okay, let's change those medals into points. And we're finished. Show me those final scores.
Welcome to Quiplash. I'm your host, Schmitty, and I've been told that I'm no longer allowed to accept tips. Everybody remember their safe word? Cool. Time for round one. You get points based on the percentage of people who like your answer, and a bonus if you get more votes than your opponent. Go! Running out. Use a safety quip if you need it. Okay, moment of truth. First one. How you know the pants you're wearing are three sizes too small? Okay, everybody pick your favorite. Title of a sex ed book from the 40s. Put in your votes. sharing a sleeping bag with this player. Float away. is Snow White's biggest complaint about living with the seven dwarfs. Ready, set, vote! say while being tortured. Time to vote.
That's it. Let's see the scores for round one. Ah. Round two is here, so let's double the points and bonuses, shall we? Okay, here we go. First off, the greatest part about having lots and lots of back hair. Okay, pick your favorite quip now. Next in line, a new children's classic, The Velveteen Blank. And vote. Up next, what God probably smells like. Vote on your devices. Your next prompt is the worst picture to see framed in your grandmother's house. It's voting time. On deck, the worst part about having a boyfriend who is secretly a highly advanced robot. Put in your votes. you absolutely should not wear white. Okay, vote! Round two is now complete. Let's see where we landed. Hmm. 
Welcome to the last lash, the final round. There's just one prompt and you're all getting it. Come up with the phrase this acronym stands for. Let's see those quips. Choose who gets a medal now. Okay, everyone, let's see who got those medals. First, the bronze. Here's the silver. And finally, gold. Let's translate that into points. That's the end. Let's see the final scoreboard. Welcome to the game. I'm Schmitty, but please don't tell my parole officer I'm here. First thing, I just want to clear up a few rumors. Very few players have died on my watch, and the ones that have deserved it. This is round one. The more folks who choose your answer, the more points you get. Go! Cool, let's see what's what. The first prompt is... The number one reported crime in Mr. Rogers' neighborhood. Okay, use your device to pick your favorite.
Moving on. A good name for a pet aardvark. Vote now. Up. A good use for 50 gallons of bacon grease. Put in your votes. Next prompt. The task that Satan's intern hates most. Get to voting! Next in the hopper, should you catch on fire, remember, stop, drop, roll, and then blank. Okay, vote. to see in Ireland. And vote. That's the end of round one. Let's take a look at the scores. Hey! Round two time and look sharp because I'm doubling all the point values. Time's running out. Use a safety clip if you need it. All right, let's have a look. Up first, a mystery that Nancy Drew couldn't solve. The case of the blank. Okay, pick your favorite. Next, 
The new menu item at Taco Bell in 2040 will be chicken blank. Time to vote. Next in line, the sequel to Shakespeare in Love would be called Shakespeare in Blank. Vote on your devices. Next one, a bad excuse for being late to your own wedding. Sorry, I was blank. Ready, set, vote. Next is the hardest part about having five secret families. Float away. Moving on, a Yelp review a millennial would leave about World War II. It's voting time. That's all for round two. Light up that scoreboard. Hi. This is round three, the last lash. One final chance to catch up and everyone gets the same prompt this time. Write a quip using these word lash rules. And here's what you did. Decide who gets a medal.
twice. Let's see who snagged the medals. Bronze. Silver. And now the gold. Great. Let me just turn those medals into points for you. All right, that's it. Time for the final scores. 